The Tito Puente Latin Music Series this year opened up with a great concert at the Dave Park with Frankie Rodriguez and El Homenaje a la Salsa. This particular concert was full with energy, great music, wonderful salsa, but not only old school salsa people were there dancing and enjoying the series and the music and the evening, all ages, everyone. This year in the 2012 Tito Puente Latin Music Series, we had Jeremy Groover's group, Revelación Latina, the Latin Project, perform at Mozart Park. Jeremy Groover is a Berkeley City Music alumna, and she performed with current Berkeley students and other Berkeley alumni, and they did an amazing job. On July 19th, we had the Tito Puente Latin Music Series for the first time at Blackstone Square on the South End. It's the first time trying that, and we had the Boston Landmarks Orchestra. We've never had an orchestra perform during the seven years of the Tito Puente Latin Music Series, so it was great, uh, in particular because it brought out all demographics, all ages. There was two-year-olds there to people in their late 80s that were out there enjoying classical music. And I hope it's a tradition that we continue, that next year we'll have Boston Landmark Orchestra on board again to do another concert. Mango Blue performed for the Tito Puente Latin Music Series in East Boston. And uh, it was a very, very special experience um, for me, especially being part of the production and participating as a musician as well. The series really has a, a beautiful interchange between the artist and the audience, and I was, I was extremely happy to uh, live it uh, with a project of my own. I had never been to a Berkeley music concert outside in the summer and it was a fabulous experience. I went to the Mission Hill concert and the setting was beautiful. It was a big crowd on site already. It was a beautiful night. The crowd was terrific. They were into it. People were on their feet, up by their performers the entire time. The Tito Puente Latin Music Series ended this year with Afro Brazil, which was alum Marcus Santos and faculty member Mikael Rehnquist. They had everybody in Ode Park dancing all night long. It was a great way to end the festival.